Thank you for tuning to NewsLink Weather. I'm Weather Forecaster Eric Segborg for Evening Forecast for your Monday. Right now we're looking at a gray day for our area. It was quite gray over portions of Wall State today, and even for much of Indiana too. And it's not just us that's seeing the gray weather too, it's much the nation as well, as we're seeing some gray skies for our area, all those some clearing out to our west, which will set us up for potentially a great day tomorrow. Although, we do also have some rain in our, in our forecast for tomorrow night as well as the resecting system to also impact our area by then, which will bring in some impacts for our weather. All the temperatures right now aren't too bad. Temperatures around 45 degrees here in Muncie, 44 degrees here in Annapolis, and 45 degrees here down in Bloomington. So not too, so the temperatures around quite seasonal for this time of year for late November standards, but it is quite chilly out there. And even for tonight, we aren't expecting the temperatures, we the temperatures to drop down too much. Temperatures will drop down to a low of 38 degrees through night tonight. Winds coming out of the southwest five to 10 miles per hour, so winds will begin to start guessing from the south, which will set us up for a great day tomorrow because of tomorrow we're expecting temperatures to, to rise back not to the 40s, not the 50s, but the low 60s by the time you get to tomorrow afternoon. Temperatures will be around 60 degrees for your afternoon high tomorrow, with, with those winds being breezy at times. Which, and with those winds, this is due to, with those winds being breezy coming in from the south, we're looking for some warmer weather for our area. So definitely a great day to get a great day to go out for a walk, go for a hammock, but definitely enjoy that warmer, warmer weather because by tomorrow night, we're expecting the rain to return as the, as the system will come through, and we'll have to bring attention for some rain for that rain and changes for some severe storms too, but the severe storms will be for our southwest portions of Indiana as they are, they're under the threat for some strong storms, so that's headed tomorrow night. But for us, we're just expecting just some general risk of some storms, meaning we might get in some of that thunder within that rain that does come through tomorrow night, but nothing waves through water. And to check out those ranges for you, starting with tonight, again tonight, we're not looking at, any, looking at much, just some cloud cover around for our area, but tomorrow morning, again, some cloud cover still in our area, but Going through the day tomorrow, looking at a gorgeous day, lots of sunshine for our area, but then by tomorrow evening, those clouds do return quickly, which will be in advance of our next system, which will come through on Tuesday evening. And by Tuesday night, we see a line of rain coming through our area. Once again, we're taking that sea weather to off to our southwest, but with us just seeing some rain, maybe even some rolls of thunder, so maybe quite noisy, especially around midnight tomorrow night. So you may end up getting waking by, waking up by some thunder around that time. But the system is also bringing in some colder air behind it as this, as this will be coming along a strong cold front. And by Wednesday afternoon, looking at some much colder weather, as the end of this front, looking at some, much, some potentially Arctic air returning to our area by then. And look at the seven-day forecast for you. It's again looking at best day weather, looking to be tomorrow. Temperatures are around 61 degrees. Again, we're expecting the storms to return by tomorrow night and then continue to early Wednesday. And Wednesday morning, we're expecting that high of 52 degrees to actually be the early morning high because after that high, temperatures will quickly drop behind that strong cold front. And we're expecting to rain cold for the day on Thursday before rebounding back up to the 50s and 60, the 50s for Friday and Saturday, which will be which makes for some mild, makes for some mild weather, but temperatures will drop back down to the 30s once you get by Sunday before rain just do return for Monday of next week as our next system does arrive. Thank you for tuning in, Newslink. Don't forget to follow us at nliweather.com. And this is Eric Segbert signing off.